What's up peeps? Welcome back to Today Live. In this video, I'm just giving you guys a behind the scenes of my Goddess Maternity Milk Bath Shoot. I made the headband myself and these are the products that I use. Zip ties and some flowers and some metallic gold paint to paint the headband and the zip ties. So this is how it's coming out. It looks really cute. I was really proud of myself. And all I did was use some super glue to put the flower petals together so I can make a actual flower because I couldn't find gold flowers anywhere. I literally took the petals, stuck them together, and after I had three sets of two petals, I stuck them on top of each other so I could make an actual gold rose. And this is the final look of the headband. I think it's gorgeous. Now let's get into this hair. I'm using the easy braid hair because I love how it matches my hair texture. And everyone knows that if it matches your hair texture, it looks a lot more real. Created one big braid and two smaller braids because I wanted to wrap around the bigger braid as you guys are gonna see. I'm starting out on an old twist out hairstyle. It's pretty dry. Um, I knew I was getting ready to do this, so I didn't want to put any extra products on my hair. So now I'm just going to be spraying it with water to just lift the products that I do have in my hair and section it off and apply some got to be gel all through my hair until it is slick into a ponytail. You, this hairstyle took a pretty long time because I don't have long hair. So it was really a struggle for me to get into a slick ponytail. But I'm pretty glad that it turned out pretty cute for this one day hairstyle and it was just for the photo shoot and I didn't take any pictures of the back of my head and you guys will see what I mean once I take off the wrap it um, after I'm done with slicking it down.
So this is what my ponytail is looking like without slicking it down completely. Did take a smaller rubber band and tie it around the bun just so it can make it a little bit smaller for when I apply the braid. So I'm going to take some extra got to be glue gel and I'm going to slick my edges down using a edge brush to make sure that it is slick, slick, slick. This side was a lot harder just because I think I did a side part and my hair isn't that long so it wouldn't reach to the back. Maybe if I did a middle part it probably would have slipped down a little bit better. And this is what I was talking about as if you're not going to see the back. So I did add a bunch of bobby pins to kind of hold it in place afterwards. But this is the final slip down and I'm going to just finish this up and add a wrap to my hair. A huge makeup person so i did do it off screen because i don't want you guys judging me like oh you did that wrong that's not right if you got some tips on beginner makeup please let me know because every video i watch i still don't understand it but anyways um it turned out pretty cute and this is how my hair looks when i take off the wraps and then i'm just gonna add the ponytail onto the back After putting the pre-braided rubber band braids around my hair, I am taking an extra piece of hair and I am going to wrap it around to hide my actual bun. Just because I didn't braid my hair into the braiding hair, you can kind of see it. This is just a one day hairstyle, so bobby pins are going to be your best friend. And I use bobby pins for the wraparound as well as for the braids that are going to go across the bigger braid.
after unraveling the perm rods this is the final look of the ending this is the tub after i finished decorating i thought i recorded me putting it all together but i didn't and this is me adding the milk and the real leaves and flower petals to the tub and thank you guys so much for watching this video of me getting ready for my goddess maternity milk bath photo shoot there are some extra photos at the ending have a great day don't forget to like comment and subscribe